and I'll do my best briefly to explain the issue. The House will recall that the Voyeurism Offences Act 2019 amended the Sexual Offences Act, and what it did, essentially, was to make it a criminal offence to take photographs up a person's skirt or, or kilt. It's sex, sexually neutral. When this is done in order to obtain sexual gratification or to cause humiliation, distress or alarm. In the debates on the current bill in the House of Commons, an amendment was proposed to add a further voyeurism offence. And the offence would be to take a photograph or a video of a woman who is breastfeeding provided that this is done to obtain sexual gratification or to cause humiliation, distress or alarm. This is, sadly, a mischief which occurs, occurs frequently, and it has understandably caused immense distress to many women victims, as has been explained by Stella Creasy MP, who was the moving force behind the amendment in the House of Commons. These women complain to the police. The police are sympathetic, but they explain rightly that there's nothing they can do about it. In the House of Commons committee debate, the minister, Victoria Atkins, for whom I have great admiration, agreed that this is, I quote, unacceptable, creepy and disgusting behaviour. Unquote. Who could disagree with that? But on behalf of the government, she opposed the amendment to make such conduct a criminal offence because the government wants to await a Law Commission report on the publication of intimate images on the internet. I can see no good reason why we should not now amend the law to make this particular form of distressing and inexcusable conduct a criminal offence. And I very much hope that the government will be thinking about this and will accept Baroness Heyman's forthcoming amendment at committee or report stage. Yeah. 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 Lords, I want to speak about a specific